In this problem, we're going to give a very rough sketch of this function. So the easiest way to do this is to think about the parent function or the uh, mother function, which is 1 over x squared. So if you look at the graph of 1 over x squared, it's pretty easy to memorize. It looks like this. It's got two asymptotes. It has a vertical asymptote at 0 right along the axis and it has a horizontal asymptote at zero, again, right along the axis, where this is the x-axis and this is the y-axis. And to me, it looks like a volcano. So I call this the volcano function. It looks like it's, it's erupting. <laughs> so this is 1 over x squared. So now all we have to do is figure out what's happening here. So whenever you add a number to the x, you go left. It's backwards. So in this case, we're going left by 3. So we're just taking this entire graph and going left by 3. So what you would do is you would draw your axes again like this. So here's x, here's y, and then your horizontal asymptote, well it's not going to change because if you're taking an infinite line, an infinite horizontal line and you're shifting it left, it's like still an infinite horizontal line. But the vertical asymptote is shifting to the left. So one, two, three. So there's our vertical asymptote. Then once you have the asymptotes, you can just think of the beautiful volcano. So here is, there's our volcano right there. And then there it is, right there. And that's it. So uh, if instead, let's say it was one over x minus three squared. In this case, it would be right three. Right, you would go the other way. It's always backwards when you add and subtract to the x. What if it was 1 over x squared plus 3? Well, whenever you add 1 to the actual y value, you go up. So in this case, up 3. And if it was 1 over x squared minus 3, then you would go down 3. So in order to do a graph, you want to memorize this for sure. Totally worth memorizing. And then just memorize these shifts, right? This one was left. This one was right, up and down. I hope this video has been helpful.